Hi, Mike here with Waiver File. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use guided access mode on an iPad to lock down your tablet to the Waiver File app so no one can use it for anything but signing. So we'll go ahead and hit the home button. And we're going to go to the settings app on the iPad. And on the left, we're going to go down to accessibility. Then we're going to scroll down a little bit and look for guided access. Then we'll tap the switch to turn guided access on. If it's the first time you're opening, it might prompt you for the passcode, but if not, you want to tap on passcode settings and you want to set the guided access passcode. I'm just going to make it one, two, three, four, one, two. And you can choose if you want the touch ID to work. That just depends if you have it set up for your fingerprint already. I'll just leave that turned on. Now, once that's done, we can tap back out of here. Guided access is enabled now. Now to use it, what you want to do is go into the app that you're going to lock down. So we'll tap on waiver file. We already have the app set up and ready to go. And so to turn it on, you're going to triple tap the home button on the iPad. And now you'll see that it says guided access has started. So now if I try to uh, swipe up or uh, hit the home button, nothing happens. It's basically locked down. So you'll actually see if I start pressing the home button, it's going to tell me that I can triple click the home button to try to get out. But when I do that, now it prompts me for the passcode in order to get out. So when you want to exit it, you're going to just do that and you can uh, enter your passcode. And you can either resume to go back into guided access and keep it there. Or you can click end when you want to go out and actually do other stuff on your iPad. So that's a quick tip. Use that to lock down your iPad to prevent uh, customers from using you know, other apps on the iPad instead of just the, the Waiver app that you want them to use. To learn more about Waiver File or to try it free for 30 days, visit waiverfile.com. Thanks for watching.